Hey everybody, Vicky here from Tales from the Trails, and this is a video on how to stop a sim from dying using what I like to call the Resurrection Stone. No mods are used, and you do need the Crystal Creation Stuff Pack. So let's get on with it. So, here we are. On my lot, for some reason my sims, or neighbours even, do like to die. And with this little stone, they come back to life. All you need to do is have it on charge, and I will take you through it. What you need is this, a hematite stone, it is the black one. And yeah, essentially it stops a Grim Reaper from taking them. So we're going to go to the gem table. Doesn't matter about the cut, we need to select the black gem, the hematite. And it, it literally makes Sims not die when it is in a proximity to them essentially, as long as it's charged. We're going to get our sim here to make that gemstone. You can have it in jewellery as well, but for this purpose we're just going to have it as a, a gem set on the side. There it is. Got it finished. So what we're going to do now, we're going to drag it over and charge it on this little disc. And wait for it to charge up. Once it's nicely charged under the moonlight. We can then test it out. So here we have, we have a sim dying of heat, heat stroke. And yep, we do have the stone nearby and he, it just resurrects him. I don't use any mods at all. It's just a Crystal Creations pack. We're just going to have a few different examples of, you know, how this little stone helps. Another heat stroke victim. Might be the same guy, actually. Put the stone nearby and, you know, Mr. Grimm can't do anything. So, this lady does die a couple times, but she comes back. Just keeping those stones charged really does help. Hope this helps you out a little bit. I'll leave you watching. All the best. And happy trails out there. Oh, my God. 